So an autonomous vehicle really has a number of components. There's the software, which is the brain of the car. Uh, there's the sensors, which helps the car look out and see the world and understand what's around it. And then there's the car itself. Uh, we focus on the software, so we are developing the brain of the car. I can say, you know, as a high-tech company, uh, I feel very lucky that we started here in Boston. It was a great place to grow our team. Uh, there's a fantastic ecosystem here where, as a startup, you can walk down the block and get VC funding, go a block further and find some of the best attorneys in the world, and really just grow your company from, in our case, two people to 20, then to 50, and then to 150. So Boston has been a great place uh, for us at Newtonomy and a big part of our success. You know, as a startup, it's hard to reach that global scale. So when we had a chance to join Aptiv, which is a company that has 157,000 employees in about 50 countries worldwide, you know, we knew that that combination, Newtonomy plus Aptiv, would allow us to take our vision to the next level. So Aptiv is an automotive tier one supplier, and their customers are the traditional automakers. But Aptiv realized that autonomous technology had the chance to disrupt their entire industry. Will they build it in-house, or will they try to partner or acquire a smaller company to get access to that tech? It just so happened that Aptiv has a great presence here in Boston. Newtonomy, of course, was founded in Boston, and so we've had a long relationship with the leadership. Today, we have a presence here in Boston. We have a group in Pittsburgh, in Las Vegas, in Santa Monica, and also in Singapore. And so we're starting to build this global footprint for our technology. So our technology promises to develop uh, systems that are safer, uh, cheaper, and more efficient than today's traditional transport solutions.